What's going on guys? It is me, the lion to your antelope, here to eat you? No, that's just inappropriate. That's pedophile language. Yeah, I knew it when I said it. Um, hey, it's Alric Phoenix, the bad video game master. I am bringing you the first episode, or upload, I guess, whatever, of my series that I'm going to be doing for the rest of the year, at slash this prestige. And that is my sharpshooter holidays, where I go through sharpshooter because it is not domination, which everyone has seen, and I don't want to do ground war because everyone's seen raid over and over again. It's so boring to me as well. And no one wants to see Nuketown because that's the same for like two years now. So that is why I'm doing sharpshooter. And it's shorter, little more compact, and you literally get to see a lot more variety in the guns because you have no choice. For those of you that do not know how Sharpshooter works, it changes guns every 45 seconds. Just any gun, any attachment. So you could go from the RPG to Riot Shield. No reason. And it is fun, and it is different, because I've never played Free For All. Okay, so first title of the video, it should say... Uh, that I got a triple feed in this, and I absolutely did, sniper only. I, you know, use my quickity quick scop skills, which I fail right before that, and get a triple feed, which if you've ever played free for all, is a hard and rare thing. So I'm pretty like, yeah, hooray me, I somehow got that lucky thing and got a sharpshooter with the XPR, uh, and I guess it's not thermal, dual band, dual band. It was cool, man! Uh, in general, though, this game, I didn't do good. <laughs> this is literally one of the f first probably ten games I ever played a sharpshooter. Uh, I've been playing a lot more. And so, there are not a lot of people playing sharpshooter at all. There really isn't. Um, like, in the mornings, and this is PS3, in the morning, when I look, there's like 300 people. At night, just under 1,000. But on the weekend, there's like 1,300, 1,500. That's how many people are on Sharpshooter right now. Very few. So when you look at like lobby leaderboards and you look at the score per minute, you know, I'm pretty average, but like skill-based matchmaking, particularly when it comes to Sharpshooter, isn't really skill-based because it's like, oh, here's a bunch of people in the 150 range to 200, and then here's like one guy who's at 400 or 500. That's how every lobby is. It's what, like, every game that I have so far for this is, I come in second! I come in second in every game! It's driving me nuts! Because there's always the one guy with, like, the 500 score per minute thrown in with everyone else. I am not an amazing player! Why do you put a guy with 500 score per minute in my lobby? It's killing me! Every game it's second. I might as well have number two tattooed on my scrotum. It's driving me up the wall, because it means I never win. And I come close, but I never get it. Because it's not really about how many kills you get, it's how long you can keep your streak going. You know, if, if there's one person that gets two streaks of 10 or 15, 12 kills straight without dying, compared to one guy who gets 30 kills but dies every two, the guy with the streaks is going to have a much, much better score. It's kind of like specialist bonusing. Yeah, anyways. So, yeah. I hope you guys... You guys should give it a try. It's a lot of fun and merriment. I really don't have anything else to talk about because I didn't plan very well. Planning is for geeks and I'm too cool for school because I'm old as dirt. Anyway guys, that is Albert Phoenix here playing my sharpshooter game one. If you like this, give me a like. If you want to comment, give me a comment. I like everything and everyone. I like you for who you are. So have a nice day. See you guys later.